And we're back. Uh, we've got two different students this time. My name is Mr. Baldwin, and we have... Jasmine. And? Adna. Adna, absolutely, okay? Um, so we just got done talking about lusters. We had the metallics and the non-metallics. Next thing we're going to start talking about is hardness, okay? So luster was a good thing to figure out first, if it was metallic or non-metallic. Next thing you want to do is figure out how hard these minerals are, okay? And hey, can we learn too? Yeah, can we learn too? <laughs> Come on in, guys. Of course you can learn. Do you need stools? No, I'm good. I like guys, it. okay, good. If you need a stool, let me know. <laughs> All right, good. So what we're learning about here, guys, is called hardness. Okay? And what hardness is, it's just a re resistance to abrasion or resistance to scratching. Okay? So like you ever write on a chalkboard? Yeah. What usually breaks? Does the chalk break or the chalkboard? Chalk. Chalk <laughs> breaks, right? So which one do you think is harder, the chalkboard or the chalk? The chalkboard. Chalkboard. chalkboard, okay? Same type of thing that we're doing here. We're trying to see which of these minerals break when you scratch them up against other things. Okay? Now, everybody walks around with some common things. You guys all have fingernails, right? Yes. Okay, yes. anybody just get their nails did? Oh, of course. Did. Good, yeah. <laughs> I just got mine done, so you know we'll have to go through that. But your fingernails actually have a hardness. And you guys have pennies in your pocket? No. Oh, good, I got a whole bunch of pennies. You guys can have some pennies, okay? Yay. So, the pennies, they actually have a different hardness too. And each thing, each mineral or each uh, item that we have has a different hardness. And we actually rank them. We rank them on a scale from one all the way up to 10. Do you guys think you know what the hardest thing is? Oh, diamonds. Yeah, diamonds, absolutely. Oh. Diamonds are the hardest material we have, the hardest mineral. Uh, and do you think our fingernails are really soft or really hard? Soft. soft. Yeah, they're really soft. soft so, like one. Uh, it's close. It's actually about, the, on the scale, let's see, at our, we're at about a 2.5 if you look at our scale. So it goes from 1 all the way to 10. And basically the softer things are close to 1. The really hard things are up towards 10. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. We're all going to grab uh, one thing. You guys have, I have more people than I thought I was going to have. So we're going to grab these two things. Does this look like it is, let's put them up over this side. Does this look like it's metallic or non-metallic first? Um, so it looks like a metal. No, it's non-metallic. No, non-metallic, okay? So we got that out of the way. Next we're going to do the hardness test, okay? So we're going to start from really soft things, work our way up towards really hard things, okay? Are we going to break them? Uh, we are going to kind of break them, okay? So what I want you guys to do first is you start with your fingernails, okay? okay. So you're going to use your fingernail and you're going to try and scratch the mineral. Tell me if you can scratch it or not. Somewhat, yeah. Ew, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can. Can you really? Yeah. Okay, yeah. so it's scraping off so just much. with your just with your fingernail, right? Yeah. yeah. So yeah. what's harder, your fingernail or the mineral? Fingernail. 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 Fingernail's harder, okay? So when we look at this, we know that a fingernail is 2.5 on the Mohs hardness scale. So it's lower. So it's going to be lower. So it's going to be about a 2. Actually, what we've got here is called gypsum. And on the table, you can see gypsum's only a hardness of 2. Okay. Yeah. Make sense? Yeah. Okay, let's try a different one. I just... Yeah, you can break them in half. We don't like you breaking them, okay? Now, remember Mr. Z last uh, video was saying that color isn't a very good <coughs> indication of a mineral's identification, okay? I've got a green one. I've got a purple one here. Are they okay. the same thing? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, they're actually the same thing, okay? So what I want you guys to do is you're going to start first with your fingernail, okay? Start soft, and you're going to go harder. Oh, can you scratch it? No. Kind of. It chip, mm -hmm. chipped off a little bit. Okay. You're looking yeah, to really, really scratch it. It should be pretty obvious that you're scratching it. Does it feel like your fingernail might be breaking too? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Your fingernail's <laughs> breaking a little bit, okay? It actually did. No. Yeah. It did. So we know we're going to be a little bit harder than our fingernail, okay? So we're going to move up the scale. So the next thing we have on here, about at a three is the penny. So what I want you guys to do is take the penny, try and scratch the mineral. See if you can scratch it. Okay, you got to scratch the mineral. Not not your uh, uh, fingernail. It can scratch. Yeah, it's scratching. It's scratching? Yeah. Getting a little bit of scratching taking place? Yep. One of the ways you can also try it too, can I steal this from you real quick? If you're not always quite sure, try scratching the other thing. Okay, so I can just take the penny and put it on the table. I'm going to use the mineral to try and scratch the penny. Okay, and actually scratch the penny a little bit. So what's harder? The mineral or the penny? Mineral. mineral. Hey, the mineral's harder because it scratched the penny. Okay, that was one of those things that wasn't quite sure if it was scratching, so I tried the other way. Definitely was scratching the penny. Okay, I gotta move to the next thing. Okay, so I'm gonna go to a wire iron nail. Okay, so we've got a couple different types of nail, and we're gonna go with the wire iron nails. So I want you guys to see if you can scratch the mineral with the wire nail now. 
like. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah. You can scratch it. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Okay, so let's think about this. So we could scratch the penny, but we couldn't scratch the wire nail. Okay, and if we look at our table, we're on page 64. So we scratched, where am I at? The copper penny, but we couldn't scratch the nail. So we're between about a 3 and a 4.5. So how hard do you guys think this is? A 4. Yeah, about a 4, somewhere in there. Okay, let's look at the table. What's about a 4? Fluorite. Fluorite. Fluorite, absolutely. You guys ever brush your teeth? Yes. Good. Yes. Okay, you wouldn't be in the video if you didn't. Okay? Um, fluorite's actually in your toothpaste. It's in our water, too, and it comes right from this mineral. Do you guys know where they mine fluorite? Caves. In Illinois. It is the state mineral. Okay? Um, it is our official state mineral. It's a really nice thing that we have. Okay? You guys think you can do it on your own? Okay. Okay. These are all the same. They have different colors. We got two pinks and one clear. I want you guys to go through the steps and talk it out as you're going through it. Okay? Tell me what you're doing. So Jasmine, tell me what you're gonna do first. Scratch my nail. Scratch with my nail. Okay. And I can't scratch with my nail. Okay. So it's harder than a 2.5. Yes. Okay. Keep going. So then the penny. Oh, no. Try the other way around. Yeah. Try and scratch the penny now. See if. If it scratches the penny, you know it's going to be harder than the penny. Yeah, it scratches the penny. Okay, so it's harder than a penny, so it's got to be harder than a 3.0. So then the nail. Make sure you get the wire nail. We use a couple different types of nails. Okay. Yeah, the nail is scratching me. The nail scratching? Are you guys getting the Not same thing? Not this one. No? Okay, you really got to make sure you're actually scratching it. Okay. Here, go. Okay, this one's not. Not scratching? No. Okay. So, no. we've gotten to the point where we're past the wire nail, so we're harder than a 4.5. Next on the list is a piece of glass. Ooh, My favorite part. Okay. So, see if you can scratch the piece of glass. That's going to be a 5.5 .5 on the Mohs hardness scale. Yeah. So, one of the things you want to do, put, this, put the glass on the table. Put that in the Yeah, put the glass on the table. And yeah, then just try and scratch the mineral. It works a little bit easier that way. Scratch him? No. Is it scratching the glass? Yeah. Yeah, so what's harder, the glass or the mineral? Mineral. Yeah. Mineral, absolutely. Okay, we're going to go even one step further. Okay. Streak plate. We haven't even learned about these yet. These streak plates have a hardness of 6.5. I want to see if you guys can scratch the streak plates. It sounds good. terrible, yeah. That's a good sound. <laughs> <laughs> mm. A little bit, not really. A little bit, not really. Okay, oh, oh, it's breaking the rock. Breaking the rock. <laughs> okay, scratching or no scratching? That's really not. Okay, can the streak, streak plate scratch the mineral? Yeah. yeah. Yeah? Okay. So they're just about at the same hardness. If you guys were to look at our table here, the streak plate's at about a 6.5. If we really got a great sample, we're actually looking at a quartz here. Okay? So if you really did it right and you got it on a good angle, it's kind of tough to see on the streak plates, but you should be able to scratch it. Oh, it sounds terrible. You should be able to scrape a little bit off. See how I'm kind of scraping a little bit off there? Yeah. Okay? That's showing me that this mineral is going to be just harder than the streak plate. Make sense? Mm -hmm. You guys want to try another one on your own? Yeah. Okay, let's see which one I want to give you. Did I use all my other ones? Oh, I think we used all our softer ones. I'm going to give you guys a tough one. Well, nail's not working. Yeah. Nail's not working, okay? So it's harder than what number? 2.5. 2.5, 2.5. good. Let's try okay. penny. Oh, definitely scratching the penny. Okay, so, so it's harder than a... 2.9. 2.9, good. So then we go to the nail. Yeah. And... It's kind of scratching it. Okay. <laughs> but it's probably because of the pointy end. Okay. So, I'm not really sure. Well, okay. Sometimes they're a little dirty too and like you're just cleaning off years and years of dust. <laughs> Does it look like harder than the nail? Harder than the nail? Yeah, yeah. absolutely. Okay. So let's go on to the glass, see if it scratches the glass. Can we get a new one? Or? Uh, you can use the same one, just make sure you're not scratching old scratches. Okay. Scratch. 
scratch oh, in the glass. Yeah, definitely yeah. scratch in the glass. You guys actually scratched up the table, too. Oops. <laughs> okay, try out Beautiful. the streak plate. My favorite part, yes. Oh, this is where you have to plug your ears. <laughs> yeah, scratching it. Yeah. Scratching it? Okay, so you guys have actually gotten to the point where you're past the hardest things we have. Okay, so you're above a 6.5. Do you think I gave you a diamond? No. No, okay. What I actually gave you guys was called corundum. Do you guys know where you find corundum? Illinois? <laughs> no, not in Illinois. That'd be awesome if you did. Uh, Africa? I don't know. Well, actually, you find it in rubies. Really? If you ever do rubies, rubies are corundum. So these are like lower quality rubies. Seven. Oh, tell you what. Let's see if it'll scratch. This is a metal file, like a nail file. So, like if you were to scratch your nails. Nah. Oh, let me do Okay? So see if you can scratch it with a... <laughs> see if you can scratch the mineral with the metal file. Yeah. So what's getting scratched, the mineral or the metal file? Check the file, see if the file gets shiny. If the file gets shiny, it's the mineral. Yeah, it's the file getting shiny. Okay, so then it's harder than a 7.0 on there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we can eliminate quartz, and now we're down to topaz and corundum. And then for this one, I just, I knew what it was, it's corundum, and uh, we don't have anything that's harder than topaz. But if we brought out topaz, do you think it would scratch topaz, or do you think corundum would get scratched? Uh, topaz, topaz would get scratched. Yeah, so that's actually what they do, is they scratch them against each other to try and figure out which one's harder. Make sense? Yep. Yeah, you guys got any questions? Are you sure you don't have any diamonds? Uh, I don't think we have any diamonds. <laughs> try it. I don't have it. I'm not blinging today. Usually I have them, you know, I'm, I got them all over the place. Okay? Um, that was hardest, guys. You did a wonderful job. Let's move on to the next one. Everybody say bye to your classmates. Bye! bye. <laughs>